Welcome, it's time for Movie Gist, and you've just seen Gojira. Oh, you guys call it Godzilla, actually. But it's actually Gojira, mm. if you ask me. That is the brand new Godzilla. It is uh, actually, Mikey should be doing this because it's all oh, your movie. No, but this is the Korean <laughs> one, yeah. For those of you who love uh, uh, the Korean industry has taken over. I mean, growing up for us, it was Indian industry. Mm -hmm. We had a lot of Indian movies. We had um, Yevada Raha, Gazab. Uh, Kuchi Kuchi Kabi. Um, and I don't remember it? these names. I wasn't you know, a big fan. So yeah, no, it, you didn't have to be a big fan. That was, mm. it would come prevalent. to you, yeah. Yes, there. But now we, I don't know their names, but I know I hear Opa and all of that. <laughs> K dramas. Yeah, K dramas. But now the thing that so happening is that even in movies, mm -hmm. look at what Squid Game did. Yeah. The point that an American franchise took mm. a hold of it. That's how much the yeah. Koreans are influencing, and they have entered into Godzilla. Mm. So this is a Korean version or a Korean take. Mm -hmm. on the Godzilla But well, it's still a Japanese it's story. It, it's a Korean take on a Japanese story. So yeah, it's still a... Yeah. Still, so, uh, yeah, so it's a Japanese thing that mm -hmm. Americans, you know... We, yeah, it was all the... Like, you know, so, I, I checked this up on Rotten Tomatoes, and yeah. first off, uh, it's already gotten, I think, uh, is it 80% on Rotten Tomatoes on IMDb? It's uh, uh, it's not 99% on Rotten... On IMDb, it is, I think, 8.5. So there's one thing about Godzilla, and I'm a big Godzilla fan, but I hate... Every Godzilla movie. Now, hear me out. I, now. I, I, I don't understand. I, because the Godzilla franchise is based, on, is based on implausibility. So I don't like it. However, there was one Godzilla that I really liked, and that was a 1998 Godzilla, the one that starred Matthew Bodrick. Because it was, it was a bit ones. real. Yeah. The older so, ones. However, for this one, I'm a bit excited because, first of all, it's Korean, like you said, and secondly, the what's it called? The the ratings are pretty good. good. So I would like to see to the see what uh, yeah, exactly. I am I'm actually excited. looking forward to this one because, um, like you said, it's a Korean take mm -hmm. on you know an, an American movie, mm. and we've come to also see that whatever the Koreans do in every face, they do it really, really well. Mm. They do. So, I mean, they do. Yeah. They do. Well, we've got more movies. Well, is this a movie or a series? We're looking forward to this one. House of Dragons is coming House out. The Dragon. Dragons is coming out I'm with another installment. This, yeah. Let's check out the trailer and then we'll be back to talk about it. Yes, indeed. House of the Dragons is yeah. out with the second season. What you guys think? What you guys expecting? Oh, yeah. For, mm. The first season ended on a very, very interesting note. The Dance of the Dragons is about yeah. to begin, and this signals the fall of the House of Targaryen. Mm. And you know, they say the house divided against itself cannot stand. Cannot stand. stand. And there's a warning from Aegon the Conqueror, who said, the, look, the, we, are, we have dragons. We are basically invincible. Mm -hmm. The only thing that can defeat us is ourselves. It's ourselves. Exactly. And that is what's going to happen. So the season two is about the Dance of the Dragons. And mm -hmm. you see dragons going up against dragons. So I'm looking forward to it. Um, You're yeah. looking forward to the dragons in particular, not the drama. Yeah. The dra oh, the drama is yeah. exquisite because mm. now, for now, we know quite a lot of the story if you've read the books. Mm. So it's how they are adapting it, that, you know. So I'm looking forward to everything. Yeah. Uh, I mean, what are you looking for, drama or dragon? You know, we, the minute Mike said the dance of the dragons, I just imagined the dragons dancing. <laughs> oh, come on, Evan, that's not what they mean, literally. <laughs> I know, <laughs> just kidding. But I was quite... Um, so the, what we, I was... I mean, we were very excited. I was one of the people that was very excited about, you know, the House of Dragons when it was released. Mm -hmm. I mean, the season one. And then along the way, I felt it was underwhelming. Oh? Uh, yeah. It Not became, enough dragons? No, no, no. It became, uh, I don't know, the direction for the story uh, wasn't as fascinating anymore. As Game but of Thrones. I yes. Mm. But I loved the way it ended. So yeah. it gave me, it's given me that, you know, um, eagerness to want to watch. I'll be very, I'll, I'll be very short. I'll just say first. First of all, I love dragons, anything dragons, even Godzilla, I love. Mm. Looking forward to um, however they're going to make this fantastic and real. Mm. That's all I'm going to say. I love dragons, I love the drama, love the epic nature, everything. So I'm looking forward to this one. All right, so who remembers Mr. and Mrs. Smith? Ah, yes, the brats. I do. Mm. And, and okay. Angela Jolie uh -huh. and Pete. Did you like it? I loved it. There's another mm. one coming out, and you never guess who it stars. Who? Let's check out the, the, the trailer and then you'll find out. It's going to blow your mind. Yes, you did not see Double. That is Donald Glover or you want to see, uh, know him Childish as Charlie Gambino. Gambino. I am looking forward to a black person playing the role of Mr. Smith. I love the original. I would like to see this one even excel more. Um, what's her name? The, the Maya Eskin. Maya Eskin. I, haven't, I, I don't really know her that much, but I'm thinking that I like that cross 
cross-pollination of cultures and yeah. for Mr. and Mrs. And, and inclusion. Let me put it. Let me put it that way. That I love what's happening there between the you know both races and you know playing the lead role. Mm -hmm. It looks interesting. It's also a comedy a comedy movie. Comedy movie, yeah, comedy exactly. Series. I say so. Well, it's a comedy, anyways. But. I'm still looking forward to it. I can, uh, please, is this coming out this year? It, my because you, I, th I feel so like so far there's been no interest I, in the I don't know. Oh, come on, no. No, I don't let's think, not get started. I don't, I don't know. I don't think it will do as well as the original you don't. one. don't. Yeah, I don't think it will do as well as the original but, one. But, but, but Donald, The thing though. is this, yeah, they, no, I mean, we did, they try. But you see, the thing is this with me when it comes to, um, their, uh, how do I put it now? Because of how well the first one did. Uh -huh. mm. And then you're trying to... Do see if you re can. Remake. Yes, see if you can. Of, uh, 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 like you said, inclusion. Okay, inclusion. I feel as much as I am there, I mean, get inclusive, it doesn't matter, but don't do it just for the sake of inclusion. Mm -hmm. Ensure that you have something We different. saw that mistake made in um, the Marvels or Miss Marvels. That was do you, exactly. You know, so don't just do it just for the sake that I want to put somebody here. Yeah, exactly. So, you know, you know uh, but, uh, but like you said, <laughs> but like you said, uh, the, 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 the trailer doesn't really... I think I'm excited. What excites me most, like you said, is the cross-cultural yeah, references. Yeah, exactly. The trailer, I think there's a bit more. It doesn't really get I, my pulse. One risk. thing that really gets me excited is the star power. Only one person, however, Donald. That guy's conquered everything from no, music also make to comedy to stand-up to mm. sitcom, everything. So seeing him in an action... Yeah, in, in recent times, he's not been there like that as know. much as in the last few years. Yeah. But like let's, see, let's see what he brings to this role. Let's see, yeah. yeah. Ah, final one. I don't know whether to call this one a movie. It's called Renaissance. <laughs> it's a film by Beyonce. Beyonce. That's what I'm going to call it. Our Queen B. They are queen. Yeah, yeah they are queen. <laughs> queen. Let's, do the, uh, let's do the trailer. Then we'll uh, come back and we'll let MM just <laughs> wax lyrical. <laughs> we'll be back. So basically, the Renaissance mm -hmm. is um, a film by Beyonce. It's more of a documentary of her world tour. Okay. And it's basically about the process behind uh -huh. the world tour. Did we need and to know. In its first opening week, uh -huh. guess how much it raked? How much? Twenty-one million dollars. It's Beyonce now. Jay Z Power. I mean, and this also went further. Somebody's to... arguing with me that it's not Jay Z Power. Yeah, no, it's not Jay Z Power. It's not Jay Z Power. Power. Do not insult Is there a power Queen couple? B. They are a power. But without Jay Z, you wouldn't have Beyonce as big as she is. Let us oh, admit no, no, that. No, 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 that's nobody. Yeah, yeah, my ear. Yeah. Yeah. You know, my are, whoa, we whoa. We are not going to have a discussion <laughs> on this show. If you People are yelling at me. If, 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 if. if Mm -mm. Really? She's, she's, she's that, that big? Conversation. Yes, she is that big. With or without Jay-Z, Beyonce is who she says All she right. is. Right. And let's also go further to um, say that because, um, you know, this also um, also sort of, she kind of like port portrayed her family, her children. Mm -hmm. You know, she, she went in, uh, not, not so much, but also like... Exposed into their yeah, lives. Exposed well. into their lives because they also featured, you know, on the right. tour with her. And it was, it's quite an amazing one. I think oh. you all should see it. Uh, I'm not absolutely yeah. excited, but I will see it for the sake of research. I just <laughs> think that this is a call out to all men of peculiar orientation to come forth, is what she's doing. Mm. Uh, drag. <laughs> you know, the, all the drags oh, and everything. Yeah. Nothing else. Nothing yeah. else. There's nothing <laughs> wrong with being who you want to be. In any case, it's been a great movie. Just hope you guys get to see all these movies and maybe give us your opinion on them. Use the hashtag whenever you can. It's Wake Up Nigeria on TVC. Let's take a break now. And when we get back, the bearded one will be giving us a, well, a helping of sports. Just in case you didn't.